Olga box clips. Uh, I am going to show, if anybody has technical difficulties, Paul's what you're doing right now. Let me show you guys how you put in a ticket with our new ticketing technical support section on the left hand side of Discord. We have moved it up to the top so you don't have to go all the way to the bottom anymore for finding tech support. Hopefully, again, everything we're trying to do is make things a lot easier for people to get access to things, a little clearer, the onboarding process going to be easier, etc. So we've got the technical support right here. Let me show you how this works. Pretty nifty. I'm going to create a ticket right now. You guys can see how this goes. All you have to do is come right down here. There's our cool little ticket bot. Click this button. It says open a support ticket. So if you click it, boom. Now it's got this neat little area. So because my name is Vinny Imini, mine says ticket Vinny Imini. But yours will be ticket underscore whatever your name is. And you'll have a private chat here where myself or one of the moderators will be able to assist you. And we'll come in here and we'll claim the ticket, whatever. But there are steps laid out here for you if you're trying to get assistance. We would ask that you do these five steps. Please include a screenshot if you don't have a screenshot utility. We have the download links right here to the free ShareX download. And if you will need team viewer assistance if you need us to remote in to get you set up or there's some more difficult issues going on with your machine install team viewer right there and team viewer has a very easy layout for you it will have the uh, id and a temporary password that you'll send over to us and we can get remoted in and get your system set up for you if you've got a simple machine id issue that we need to get squared away for licensing you can include your machine id and of course describe your issue in detail and of course the picture's worth a thousand words so please help us out and include a screenshot when possible it's real simple you just use it just like you would discord right down here you can copy paste screenshots in there you can attach files all kinds of cool stuff right there just put it in and then myself curtis or one of the moderators will get you set up and working um so yeah as far as getting started there you go so i could type in here and say um please check my machine id thanks and then hopefully i would put in my my machine id there we go and some nice person would come and finish it. Now, the trick with these is there's a close button here. Uh, but up here on the left, you'll see the tickets. Now, Target you guys filled. don't see other people. These are the other people that have put in tickets. Only the moderators, because I'm a moderator, I can see these. But you see there's a little privacy DC key on there. On the two. So that chat is private between you and the ticket claimer. Whoever claims a ticket to work on it with you. And then when we're done, so you'll see there's the ticket that I just created right there. When I'm done with it, I'm going to press close. Now I can press close with a reason because I'm the guy um, solved. I'll hit submit right here. And bada bing. That ticket has been logged and we've got a cool little ticketing system now where we can see all of our tickets and tracking and all that kind of good stuff and keep people credit for helping and all that. Press the like button, share, subscribe, and comment below with your thoughts and what you'd learn.